Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the React. In the last video, we have done the React Blender example. Now we are going to use the React date range with the help of the React Blender. So those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So here you can see that you can select that range. Okay, selected ranges, this one, <coughs> Friday, May to this. Or you can also expand for this one also, like the like here you will go with this one for that for this just make it press and april 2 to this one so this is basically the data range so you can select like this let's dive into the code level how we have implemented so here we have a calendar component so here we go with this one so <coughs> calendar from the react calendar and the react and the use state from the react right so here we have a default states okay so basically it accepts basically it's a current dates right so it's expect expect new date 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 only right <clears throat> so here we go with the whenever there's a change so we will select that or print that date range right so what we have to do on change value and here we have a select range make sure to make it select range to be true to implement the date range picker right so if passing this one so it will help you to just select the date range right so after this uh, for printing one you will go with the data re date range with zero fit two date string hyphen two date string one okay so this is how you can get it also so this is the basic example for the date range picker using the react calendar <coughs> right so any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day and don't forget to like share and comment on my video have a nice day